everyone and um, I know it's been a while since I did a video but I just found the time to I was so busy before but I found the time to make a video for you all so since spring is here even though it really doesn't feel much like spring because it's kind of cold outside still um, I'm still gonna do a spring look I'm gonna do a spring eye a simple spring eye and lip look um I did it in my face so we're not sitting here and waiting for that um because I'm gonna do, this is not like a full tutorial, this is more like an eye and lip tutorial um, I'm gonna do today. Um, I'm gonna make a full tutorial in the future, um, but I just haven't found the time lately. So I finally found the time to sit down and record a little tutorial for it all. And I'm gonna show you how to get this simple, a simple winged eyeliner and um, retro coral lip, which is really simple, it takes you 10 minutes to do. And yeah, I'm going to show you all how to do it and watching for the tutorial. Okay, the first thing I want to do is add a little dimension to my crease. So I'm just going to take my trusty, dusty Anastasia Beverly Hills Shadow Couture Palette. And I'm going to dive into the warm Morocco shade right there. And um, I'm just going to take this shade, take a little bit on my brush. It's just a fluffy brush and tap off the excess because it's pigmented. And just go in the crease. And this is going to add some definition to the crease. This is probably the only eyeshadow we're going to add. Except maybe a little bit for the inner corner because we cannot forget the inner corner glow of our eye. And then for the inner corner highlight, I'm going to go into some of this spoiled shadow right here. I'm going to go into some of this spoiled shadow right here, and I'm just going to take it on my little index finger, and I'm just going to dip it, and I'm just going to pop it in the inner, inner corner, just for that extra highlight. And then for a little definition on the bottom lash line, I'm just going to take a little bit of that Morocco, and I'm just going to swipe it really quickly under the bottom lash line to make some definition. Alright, now I'm going to be doing my winged eyeliner, and I'm going to be using my NYC liquid liner. I'm going to do this off camera because... I mess up a lot and it's just easier for me to do it off camera so I'll be right so I'm back I applied my wing eyeliner and some white eyeliner on the bottom lash line I just use this NYX retractable white eyeliner pencil it's gonna apply some mascara to the top and bottom I applied some mascara, now I'm going to apply my lashes, favorite, my Ardell Glamour Lashes and the Style 106. I applied one pair of lashes to one eye and then I'm going to apply another pair to the other eye and I'll be right Now I applied lashes to both eyes, now we're going to go, now we're done with the eyes, now we're going to go to the lips. For the lips I'm going to be using this corally red color. Um, it's the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color in the shade, I believe this is Amore. Yeah, it's called Amore, the shade. So I'm just going to apply it. All right, this look is finished. Um, this applied more like a gloss than a matte lip cream, so this is kind of like false advertisement because it feels more like a gloss and it's not really drying down like a liquid lipstick like I thought it would be. But um, thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this look. And um, please like this video. Please like this video and subscribe to me if you're not. So yeah, I hope you all like this spring tutorial. And I see you all next time. Mwah. I got lipstick on my finger.